Pacific Northwest Seismic Network is responsible for monitoring earthquakes and volcanoes in Washington and Oregon. There are a lot of Seahawks fans here at the PNSN, and so of course we're all watching the playoffs with the New Orleans Saints in 2011. Dr. John Vidali, our director, noticed the crowd just leaping up and down after Marshawn Lynch's historic run. And so he thought that, you know, that's enough energy that I bet our strong motion seismometer, where the old kingdom used to be, or nearby, would be able to pick that up. So he looked and sure enough, he found the signal and so the beast quake was born. So we have three seismometers set up in CenturyLink Field. Those seismometers measure any type of movement that the crowd does. 60,000 people shaking a building makes these things really rock. That is then sent to our computers back at the UW, and I'm able to connect to that immediately and put it out on QuickShake. I have three servers available to me for building web products. Those three servers just weren't enough firepower to serve all the Seahawk fans who wanted to watch the seismogram live. That's when I contacted the Azure team and they got to work immediately. We saw a clear cloud need for uh, what we call on and off peaking use cases. So this is a typical solution that only needs to be on for a few hours, but needs to scale to several orders of magnitude above what the normal usage is. QuickShake allows any user to use any web browser, and connect to our data, and see it within three seconds of actual seismicity happening. That has not been done prior to this. We ingested all the data that was here in the lab that we were getting real time, and then we pushed that into the cloud we made several streams out of that information and then we could do analytics, we could do the graphics, we could do uh, mobile application notifications, we could do many more things uh, just by plugging those components. So what Azure provided us was the scalability. What they did allow us to do was serve the maximum amount of clients. As the load increased, they just added more nodes and more nodes and more nodes. We used cutting edge technologies to ensure, for example, with web sockets that we could stream what could potentially be really scientific complex data, in this case, used the direct streaming from the seismometers at the field to someone's browser and to make that into a graphic that's familiar for everyone and actually into a concept that's familiar for everyone. During an earthquake, we take a tremendous amount of traffic and that tremendous amount of traffic can come at us at any one time. We have maybe a minute of warning at best before we get slammed by all the, the users coming to our website because everybody wants to know what just happened. Being able to move this to the cloud will help us serve as many people as possible. This is where we get to potential future applications for this type of technology, such as weather forecasting, for example, social media analysis, marketing automation, and many other scenarios where you need to get quick real-time data from the field and present that to many users in many different screens to many different audiences. This whole experience brought us one step closer to being able to do truly real-time information products to a very expanding audience. Our background is maybe a few hundred people a day and then expand out to many thousands almost instantaneously. When a volcano erupts, when a big earthquake strikes, we need that capability. And our commitment from the beginning was to make sure that we wrote down everything, every single learning that we had, uh, shared that with PNSN as well as with uh, our teams across the globe, and that we open sourced uh, every single piece of code that we created for this project, which is now uh, posted on GitHub. So by looking at, at that, you know, the opportunity to add value to a community, the opportunity to do something local, the opportunity to learn as well, I think those three things are motivating enough for every one of us to participate in this project.